ओम श्री अरविंदो मेरा इज माई रिफ्यूज ओम श्री अरविंदो शरण मम ओम श्री माता शरण मम गुड इवनिंग टू यू ऑल वेलकम टू दिस ग्रेट स्पिरिचुअल कंग्रीगेशन टुडे सो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टुडे वेरी ब्रीफली और ए वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक दैट इज सुपर माइंड वी आर ऑल अक्वेंटेड विद द टर्म माइंड बट सो फार आवर स्पिरिचुअलिज्म इज कंसर्न एंड फॉलोइंग द स्पिरिचुअल लाइन एज डिरेक्टेड बाय मदर एंड श्री अरविंदो ऑल्सो सुपर माइंड इज नॉट एन अननोन टर्म और ए न्यू टर्म फॉर अस सो वेन वी आर कंसिडरिंग द सुपर माइंड दर मस्ट बी ए माइंड सुपर माइंड इज द अपेक्स एंड माइंड इज एट द बॉटम सुपर माइंड इज द चीफ एंड माइंड इज द माइंड ओनली इन एन ऑक्जिलरी रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ द सुपर माइंड सो माइंड हैज बीन परवर्टेड इन द प्रोसेस ऑफ इन्वोल्यूशन इट हैज कम ऑलमोस्ट अप टू द बॉटम माइंड लाइफ एंड बॉडी सो इन फॉर दिस माइंड टू राइज ऑफ द इन द इवोल्यूशनरी प्रोसेस एंड टू बिकम द सुपर माइंड देर आर फ्यू लेयर्स आर देर दैट वी नो इन बिटवीन दिस माइंड एंड सुपर माइंड वी हैव गॉट वन स्पिरिचुअल माइंड इन बिटवीन दैट कॉन्स्टिट्यूट्स हायर माइंड इलो माइंड माइंड इंटुएटिव माइंड एंड ओवर माइंड एंड एट लास्ट वील गो फॉर दिस सिग्निफिकेंट सुपर माइंड नाउ इट सेल्फ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस फ्यू लाइन्स इन द राइटिंग्स ऑफ फॉलोइंग द राइटिंग्स ऑफ स्टी ओर विंदो इन द लाइट ऑफ स्टी ओर विंदोज राइटिंग the super mind or super mental the truth consists the what is actually meaning we mean by super mind the truth consciousness the truth in its possession of itself and fulfilling fulfilling itself by its own power this super mind itself constitutes the truth consciousness its fundamental character is knowledge by identity the most एक्जिक्यूटिव टर्म द मोस्ट एक्सक्लूसिव टर्म श्री ओर अबंध हज यूज टू दैट फॉर हर नॉलेज बाय आइडेंटिटी बाय दैट सेल्फ इज नोन बट ऑल्सो द ट्रूथ ऑफ मैनिफेस्टेशन इज नोन दैट इज नोन एज सुपर माइंड सो सुपर माइंड कॉन्स्टिट्यूट्स द हायर ट्रूथ कॉन्सियसनेस द ट्रूथ एंड इट इज रिप्रेजेंटेड इट इज एक्चुअली वी फील द सुपर माइंड सुपर मेंटल टच विथ द विथ नॉलेज बाय आइडेंटिटी फ्यू टर्म्स फ्यू डेफिनेशंस एंड फ्यू इंडिकेशंस आज गिवन बाय श्री अरविंदो वी आर गोइंग टू टेक इट बाय टुडे आज वी नो माइंड इज मैन द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ मैन द डेफिनेशन ऑफ मैन हैज बीन कम फ्रॉम कम फ्रॉम द वर्ड माइंड बिकॉज देर इज माइंड मैन इज सो फ्रॉम द माइंड विच इज वी आर मैन सो लाइक आज फ्रॉम द माइंड द मैन इज इवॉल्व वी आर गेटिंग द टर्म मैन आवर ह्यूमन बींग मेंटल बींग माइंड इज मैन लाइक दिस श्री अरविंद द स्पीक्स ऑफ सुपर माइंड इज सुपर मैन फॉर दिस फ्रॉम फॉर दिस माइंड is man super mind is super man only one relative word is attached that is known as super man mind is man super mind is super man mind is man beyond thought it cannot soar so it is confined it is actually at the bottom of the involution it is at the near to the almost near to the um, matter <laughs> Still, the speaks of super mind is something beyond mental man and his limits. We are, as already I have expressed, man is considered to be a mental man. So he has got so many limitations, so many bounds, so many finiteness. Super mind is something beyond mental man and and his limits. This mental man, beyond this mental man, long, 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 we have to cross in a big manner. We have to cross the limits, and after that only crossing, overtaking, overcoming so many layers. so many steps we are we will be able to know know and feel the touch of super mind truth in the super mind is self found and self existence so the basic is truth only truth and that is capital t only that divine truth that is in super mind is self found and self existence it is auto- automatically there truth nothing but truth is there truth in the super mind so is self found and self existence 
नेक्स्ट द सुप्रमेंटल थॉट इज नॉट द मीन्स ऑफ अराइविंग एट द ट्रूथ द सुप्रमेंटल थॉट वेन एवर वी स्पीक ऑफ सुपर माइंड वेन एवर वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द सुप्रमेंटल थॉट इट इज नॉट नॉट ए मीन्स ऑफ अराइविंग एट द ट्रूथ बट ए वे ऑफ एक्सप्रेसिंग इट not the so that not that we are going and arriving at the apex arriving at the truth but the way of expressing it expressing her the way of expressing the truth and the truth that is not ordinary truth that is the divine truth the truth in its whole the supramental thought again is not the arrow from the light the supramental thought thought it comes from the mind but actually it is perverted now this thought is coming from the mind and we think it is one it is ours and it is full after some time we contradict because whatever thought we have taken it for sure now after some time we think that is contradictory and that is also you know packed with errors so supramental thought it is coming from the supramental super mind the supramental thought not from the original ordinary mind in the bind of surface or sub surface mind supramental thought in is an arrow from the light not the bridge to reach it where it is not bridging the gap but actually it is an arrow shot from the bow to reach at the light so supramental we are when we are considering about the super mind mind that is actually full truth and the full light the super mind alone can transfer the lower nature there are two natures are there we find one is higher nature one is lower nature the higher nature it has come to the lower nature who higher nature something light infinity boundless and in higher in when we are coming about the thinking of lower nature that is actually perversion that is some negation that is some bounded boundless boundless some limitation some finiteness so super mind alone can transform this lower nature this lower nature can be only transformed by the supramental sense so for this once again i want to stress it this lower nature can only be transformed by the super mind alone till over mind who even if the light is coming or the power is penetrating to inside this thick layer of the matter then it is it can penetrate it can grill it can to some extent change but it can transform only matter and the lower nature can be transformed with the touch of the supramental light and supramental force that has got the transforming power it is only the super mind that the full truth consciousness comes into being in the super mind only total full truth consciousness come into being without super mind nothing can be done even if up to the over mind over mind we know in the hierarchy of the minds spiritual mind whenever we talk of the spiritual mind higher mind in rubain mind intuitive mind over mind over mind is the passage to the super mind but still then it is only the super mind that is full truth consciousness comes into being everywhere it has got its limitation even if it is going in the hierarchically this layers of mind but super mind is full it is full full truth consciousness comes into being it is rationality and the prudence to distrust the supramental but to believe in it also a sort of wisdom naturally it needs higher wisdom to go for the supramental super mind and the supramental if there is only we are considered with prudence and rationality then naturally we may not be able to trust the fullness of the super mind so it needs a prudence it needs rational rationality to believe the sort of it needs some wisdom sort of wisdom is needed required to uh, trust the supramental super mind it is only the supramental that is all knowledge only supramental is all knowledge nothing in no way others can be considered as to full knowledge all knowledge is only supramental the first condition of the supramental change is to get rid of ego ego is the bar here ego was the helper in the initial phase but now ego stands as a bar in the supramental creation so the first condition of the supramental change is to be to be get rid of ego there is no place for ego naturally we have to be get we have to be devoid of the ego we have to be bereft of ego we have to come out of the ego there is no place in the supramental light don't imagine that truth and falsehood light and darkness 
this surrender and selfishness can be allowed to dwell together in the house consecrated to the divine. So for the supramental change, naturally, we must be get rid of the ego. ego. Power comes inevitably by the supramental change. It is a necessary condition for perfect action. Power comes inevitably by the supramental change. With this supramental change, definitely power descends and power comes. This is the necessary condition for the perfect action. This supramental power, when it is coming, then only the true and perfect action will stand take place. The ascent to the supramental truth is not only raises us from spiritual and essential consciousness to the height, but also brings about a descent of the light and truth into the all beings and all parts of the nature. So, it actually, these two types of work simultaneously is performed. One is a descent and an, one is ascent and second one is descent. Simultaneously, both the process takes place. And this is, actually, this is the way Ascent to the supramental truth is not only raises our spiritual and essential consciousness. It has to be ascended, it has to be elevated, it has to be taken up to the height. Simultaneously, there must be a descent of the light and the truth. From the below, there is a spiritual and essential consciousness to the height that must be, it must be raised up. And the descent will be light and the truth higher light and a higher truth, supramental light and supramental truth into the all being and all parts of the nature for this transformation because as we know the matter's thickness is very rigid, it is rigid, very thick, very difficult to be changed, very darkness, very obscured. So for that it has to come, it has to descend down. The supramental change is a thing decreed and inevitable in the evolution of the earth consciousness. This supramental change is a must decreed and inevitable in the evolution of the earthward, earth consciousness. Its upward, ended, uh, upward uh, ascent is not ended and mind in the last summit. But that the change may take place. For that, there must be a will to recognize, not deny the light when it comes. And in that is needed the sanction of the Supreme. So the power one, we have to aspire. Second, the sanction has to come. The power that mediates between the sanction and the call is the presence and power of the Supreme Mother. So she has there, Divine Mother is with her, with us. So here, inside, along, among us, to go, go for this supramental change and the, to mediating between the sanction and the call. A vast universality of the soul, intense with, uh, unity with all, is the base and fixed condition. Another base and fixed condition are two, a vast universality of the soul. Second, an intense unity with all, intense unity with all and vast universality that is the base and fixed condition of the supramental consciousness and the spiritual life. Naturally, spiritual life is a must. The supramental yoga is at once the ascent towards the God. Also here, ascent and descent, two terms are being expressed. Supramental yoga is at once a ascent towards God and a descent of Godward, Godhead into the embodied being. So, when we are going to conclude here very shortly, this is supramental change, this truth consciousness as we know. So, to conclude, the super mind, mind shall be the nature's found. The eternal truth shall mood his thoughts and acts. The eternal truth shall be the light and guide. All then shall change, a magic order come. Another also person, Sri Aurobindo writes in his Savitri, the super mind shall claim the world for light and thrill with the love of God the enamored heart and the peace, place, lights crown on nature's lifted head and found lights rain on her unsinking base. Then only this purpose will be solved. Thank you.